spectacles or eye glasses you must have seen some people in your life wearing glasses some of your own friends too will be there who wear glasses why do these people wear glasses we must have heard oftenly that their eyes have become weak the vision is not clear so they wear glasses but what is the exact reason behind the eyes to be weak or the vision to get blurry in our previous video we learned about the various organs of the eyes but weakening of which organ reduces the vision of our eyes stay tuned till the end of the video to find answers to some of the similar questions but before knowing the defects of vision it is important to understand a concept first known as power of accommodation what does the power of accommodation mean have you ever noticed that within a couple of moments we can see the distant objects and read the story written in the book without time lapse between the two episodes but is it as easy as it looks no as we have already known that the lens in our eye changes its size or focal length with the help of ciliary muscles due to which we are able to see these different objects in a time of a second in order to see a nearby object the ciliary muscles contract then the lens becomes thicker and the focal length reduces and we are able to see the nearby objects comfortably In the second case the ciliary muscles get relaxed which makes the lens thinner and the focal length increases which helps us to see the distant objects clearly You must have noticed that you can't read while keeping a book very close to your eyes Why is it so Because our lenses can increase or decrease their focal lengths to an extent For a normal eye this distance is 25 cm which is called near point to read a book properly we need to put it at least 25 cm away similarly the far point is at infinity one reason for the eyes to become weak is that the power of accommodation gets reduced there are broadly four types of defects of vision the first one is myopia which is also known as nearsightedness The person having myopia is able to see the nearby objects but finds it difficult to see the distant objects clearly. In this the image of the object forms not on the retina but in the front of it. Now you may be wondering why the image is formed at the front of the retina instead of on the retina? They are formed because in this defect curvature of the lens or the curvature or axial length of the eyeball increase due to which the convergent capacity of the eye increases and the image forms in front of the retina. This defect is common with the growing children because with time the size of the eyes increases. These are the same children whose mention was there in the beginning of the video. If you ask them they will say that we do not see the distant objects clearly. As the converging power increases in this defect, hence the converging power will have to be reduced to correct it. But the power cannot be reduced. So it is intended to diverge the light coming from the outside. And for this, we can put a divergent lens or concave lens in front of the eyes and let the image be formed on the retina. second defect which is also known as far sightedness or hypermetropia a person with hypermetropia can see distant objects clearly but finds it difficult to see the nearby objects distinctly in this case the image is formed behind the retina as the focal length of the lens increases or the eyeball shrinks the image is formed behind the retina So a converging or a convex lens is taken to converge it to the exact point making the image on the retina. The power of the lens in both the cases is taken care by putting the lenses of the exact power in the spectacles. Apart from spectacles these defects can also be overcome through various types of surgery. The third defect which is known as presbyopia. In this defect it is difficult for a person to see both far and near. Aging is the reason behind this defect for most of the people. Where both the muscles and the lens get weakened. To correct this defect, doctors ask to wear eye glasses of proper power having bifocal lenses. The lower part of these lenses is made up of convex lens and the upper part is made up of concave lens. 
Besides these three, there is another eye defect which people face during old age, known as cataract. But what exactly is cataract? We all have protein in the lens of our eyes. With increasing age, these proteins accumulate in the lens and after a certain time, the lens becomes milky in color. Due to this, the lens loses its transparency and there is difficulty in seeing. The only way to cure this defect is surgery. The doctor replaces the defected lens with another artificial lens. Cataract is a very common disease from which we should not be afraid. The surgery lasts for just 15 to 20 minutes and the person's eyes become like the new one. But if cataract is not treated at the right time, then it can cause permanent blindness to the eyes. So kids, by this video we are able to understand what actually happens with those who wear eyeglasses and how much they go through every day which we can't even imagine.